Gladiators, uh, too, too much, too much to say. Too many, oh, too many right. syllables. All right, yeah, you need, you need to stop. <laughs> Get that dream world out of here. But let's go. NRG Naro going up against Phoenix One's own Captain Zach, and these guys have definitely a storied history overall in Smash. Oh, indeed, man. It's gonna be exciting to see. Whoa, and that. Okay, okay. scary situation right. there. Captain Zack took Nairo way to the top and got so much damage. You know, that was, a, that was a fighter, DB Fighters combo. Dude. Oh, it really was. <laughs> you if you guys play DB Fighters, you know, man, them combos, they hurt. The aerial launcher, man, you go up. <laughs> as much as those combos hurt in DB Fighters, a lot of times I'm always guessing that someone won't get KO'd from the uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, right. I'm always like, yeah, they're not KO'd yet. But anyway, here we go. <laughs> Nairo, of course, you know, when it comes to Bayonetta and both uh, Zero Suit Samus, as long as you're able to farm that rage, you're able to bring it back. Here it is Nairo, of course, getting caught right there by, Cap uh, by Captain Zax, which time, you know, you gotta have to be careful in, oh, for that option. It's so scary because even if you go for a move that may have really low hits on like a jab, for some reason, which time gives you so much, yeah. <laughs> like no play time. You, you basically get put in timeout. Oh, it's like, hey, why did you make fun of Bayonetta? Go in timeout. Oh <laughs> and then you, 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 you basically look at the wall, <laughs> yeah. and you, you can't talk to anybody if you say anything. Yep. The, the yep. timeout gets clapped up. It clapped up. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> uh, right now, of course, uh, just in our other matches that are going on, Fallen was able to go ahead and beat Frozen Neck 3-1. So Fallen's going to be advancing on, of course, in this top 32. Or the kind of hero, the hometown hero. He's going to have to sit aside for a bit. That's it, man. It's rough, man. It's rough. But great job right there, like you said. AC, right? Represent? Yep. All right, here we go. Managing to get out of that situation with the flip kick. Okay, let's see. Down and away usually works out in those situations when you deal with Bayonetta's bear. Uh, those side, those um, offstage horizontal combos, yeah. a lot of times you see people get caught by that time and time again. All you have to do is incorporate the proper DI and you'll be able to get out of there, you know? Absolutely, also absolutely. But, you know, like I said before, uh, going back to Fallen Bros. Neck, like, it, I think it's crazy that we've seen Fallen Neck be able to do the things that he was able to do. Oh, yeah. Fallen against Ally. We've seen Ally have an issue with Locust and stuff before, so it's great to see that these rears are coming out to play. Unfortunately, like you said before, Fallen was able to take that 1 3 1. So. Fallen is just such an amazing player, dude, if you really think about it. Like, Fallen, uh oh, that was a scary situation right there for Naira. Almost, uh, well, the, here's one of the things about Naira. Even though he may bust out that boost kick in neutral, he, it's not like he'll do it a lot of times. You know, he'll just go for like one guess. Yeah. Which, for him, he didn't get a hard punish. Anyway, but yeah, Fallen has been on the rise in the Southern California scene. And, it, I, oh my Whoa! god, what the? Heck? Get kicked! What the? Get heck? kicked! <laughs> so, uh, I thought Homeboy had enough invincibility, and unfortunately, I was caught off guard. Oh, yeah, him too. <laughs> oh, geez, you man. think he's better than that? <laughs> wow. I have to say, though, I do love Captain Love Zach's the Bayonetta glasses. glasses. Yes, yep. man. I, play, I, play, I finally got to play Bayonetta 2 on the Switch. It's pretty good, And man. It's, it's clean. Yes, it is. It is clean, man. Those right. combos. But here we go. Now wow. go. Okay. Get the wow. Ready, go. Yeah. It just goes yeah. for the dash grab? Yeah. <laughs> Why not? Get yours. That's crazy, man. Xander was like, wow, I'm not even done saying yeah. go yet. Yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Speaking of which, Xander Mobis actually does like Smash Brothers. He does watch. But a lot of times, you know, he doesn't want people to blow up the chat if he talks. So, you know, he just, just watches incognito. Sorry for yep. blowing you up, Xander. But anyway, we out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Love your work. Yep, absolutely. Oh, Ooh, and right crouch. there. Crouch. Yep. Here's the thing, though. I mean, yes, the crouch may work out, but uh, it doesn't look like it helps him avoid grabs. Oh, oh, tough situation, the immediate. Yeah, yeah. Twitch, twitch, to be up at. Oh, and here we go. You know, yep, all the enough, damage in the world. It was crazy seeing what was happening in the first game. We did see a witch time confirmation, right? That yep. uh, got rid of a stock for Naira, but Naira did end up taking the first game. Let's see what happens here, because a lot of Zero Suit Samus's don't like this match. Yeah. And a lot of. A lot of people usually have a hard time against this character because of the fact that, you know, usually they have either negative or even matchups with the character. I mean, if it's even, it's not that bad. But, uh, yeah, Zero Suit Samus is out here usually have matchups. Yeah, I mean, it's just a rough matchup, I feel, in them. Because, again, when you're looking at Zero Suit, the character, you're usually going to start off a lot of your offense. Footstool. Yeah, you're dead. Footstool. Yeah, see ya. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, yeah, let me get that close-up of those glasses, man. Bayonetta. Bayonetta. Definitely nice glasses right yep. there. Focused. This is uh literally Bayonetta incarnate. This is definitely Got Bayonetta that. too, as uh yeah. she has the uh you know the short hair. Short hair, yeah, yeah. So yeah. it's inspired, it's inspired. Yeah. Bayonetta two in real life, and then <laughs> in the game, Bayonetta one, man. I'll expect it. Alright, here we go. Expect. So one one. Okay, Nairo looked like he was about to go for the dash grab again. Oh yeah. But he was like, actually, it's like 
I feel like it was a plot twist. Yeah. <laughs> Not gonna do it. Nope. It's all about mix-ups when it comes to this. But can we talk about being able to, like, low-profile with Bayonetta? Because we saw the Nair actually win. Yeah. So going back to what I was talking about before, yeah. uh, one of the things is that you're going to see, uh, essentially, all offense come from a short hop from a zero suit, or it's going to come from a grab. So it's just going to be really rough because, again, Bayonetta has a great crouch. Uh, Bayonetta, even though her neutral not super crazy great, uh, it, you know, it's okay. And you know what? Oh, my goodness. Yep, that was basically it. Six <laughs> spike attempt right there. That down there is so strong. I mean, even not even as a spike, but just as a move that has, like, great great knockback and control, you know? Yep. Oh, great DI there on the heel slide. Nairo is doing a good play. He's good amount of damage. Let's see if he get this landing. Yep. Right there, you know, notice how Captain Zack could walk. Using that DI as well to try to see if he can avoid. Okay, good move right there by Zack. Yeah. Nairo is going for a lot of grabs every time he saw those crouches. Ooh. Spike would have been scary. Yeah. Put Nairo in a situation where it would have been a 2 1 scenario right there. Okay? Okay. Immediate jump. Boost Bye. back. Good confirmation. 62%. A lot of times, people who are uninitiated will think that this is a bad situation for Nairo, but <laughs> I'll tell you right now, man. Nairo probably might be smiling with yep. this person. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good delay on that third grab, too. Absolutely. Deciding to pull back a little bit. Not trying to get caught by those neutral beams. Okay. Okay, here it is. Grab one. Easy, 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 two. But we Good do damage. have the have a bat with it, man. Yep. And that's gonna come, That's what's going to come into play, especially you're not going to be in the percent where it's actually guaranteed. Now it has to watch out. We might see a potential witch type. Captain Zack not afraid to pull it, especially in situations where Nyla may look like. Uh-oh. Oh, this is. Oh. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that witch twist. Go ahead and do that witch twist. Go oh, ahead and do that there it is, Nairo giving Captain Zack that Hold elevator up. treatment right there. Yep. Why not? And Nairo the bellboy. He's like, do you want to see the roof real quick? Yeah. Uh, I got the keys. Yeah. Would you like to see the top of the Luxor? Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll show you the top of the standard Ooh. here in uh, downtown Los <laughs> Actually, uh, downtown Los Angeles, they have the standard. Do they have the standard here in Las Vegas? All right, let's go back to the Luxor. So a big shout out to the Luxor. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> shout out. <laughs> here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Two, one. Situation here. Man. So already an hour is going to be up. But, I mean, we've seen Captain Zack. That game two was absolutely insanely explosive. So you said saline. Insanely. Okay. I thought, I thought you said saline. I said saline. there was uh, NACL involved. Wait, wait. Oh, okay. I wonder if it was because he was like way too close right there. But Nairo trying to see if he can just like go head to head with that neutral air. Okay, Zach, Yang away, getting right back into the fray. Nairo so quick up on the trigger, dude. Yep. Very oh, what smart. <gasps> Zach was oh. like, I'm not gonna air yeah, dodge. Yeah, yeah, like, what do you think I'm doing? I'm not air dodging in this situation. I'm literally gonna just fair and intercept you as you flip kick back, expecting me to air dodge so you can get that spike. Yep. See, what a chase. Yeah, dude. I love seeing the fact that, you know, we're here at the very last year of Smash 4 and so many people, wait a minute, and trying to see if they can get that opportunity to, you know, leave their mark. I think that's the best way to leave when it comes to this game, right? Leave yeah. your mark, man. Absolutely, On a high man. note, too. Absolutely. And the thing is, all this stuff moves forward into the future. Yeah. Learn now. Reap the reward later, right? Yeah, and Nairo getting out of that situation. We do have some invulnerable flames. Flames. Frames. Flames. Yeah. I mean, that was Flames. That was Flames. <laughs> oh, but here it is. Neutral just getting him away. Nairo aggressive. Yes. Yeah. That could have been a witch side, but Nairo was like, nope. Oh, Ooh, run it back. back. Yes. <laughs> run it Put back. The fist right out there. Yep. I love it, man. See, both of these guys just go at it. Okay, Nairo not going for the grab confirmation. Instead, try to put Captain Zack in a situation where he could shark from beneath with that up smash after the nail. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Up. Nairo employing the decent, the good DI, yep. allowing him to get out of that situation. You know, when it comes to fighting against Bayonetta, you have to watch out for that second hit of the Witch Twist. And if you do get hit by it, at least make sure you get away from the up air. Exactly. Okay, so you can go for heel side there. So you're getting an easy punish. We're going up here. And kicked. Oh! oh get reversed. Uh, and there it is. Nairo moving on to the winner's side with a 3 1 win yep. over Captain Zack. I have to say, man, that was a scary match. A lot of people probably going into this after seeing how many times.